So we've got a video here about the dramatic fucking transformations on meth, on coke, on crack, on Charlie, on ice, on the goey. <sighs> Wanna get some goey? I used to have drugs in the past in the 90s. I mean, just got my share, fair, fair share of stories and personal experiences. When I used to do amphetamines and, and stimulants, I wanted to start running. We'd go to the dance parties and we'd dance and just I, just... I used to walk out of the rave and just go for a run. I was just like so <laughs> charged up. Most people do amphetamine. Now, I don't recommend. I recommend get off the gear, man. Get off that shit because it fucks up your metabolism. Most people, most people, not all, but most people do cocaine, methamphetamine, amphetamine, ice, crack, cocaine, whatever. Most people do it because they want to get leaner. They want to do it for weight loss. I know it's going to be hard for a lot of people to digest, but have you ever done drugs? Have you ever been in a drug culture? I'll tell you what. The number one consumer of drugs, who are they, man? They're people who want to get lean on Wall Street, in models, in fashion, in bodybuilding, whatever. People want to get lean, so they do stimulants because you're like, just buzzing. You don't want to eat, so you reduce your calorie load, so you get all lean. But it fucks up your metabolism long term. That's why you see all those hot chicks used to go to rave parties when you're 18, 19. You see them when they're 40, doesn't make them bad people, but it just goes to show long term, you don't want to be doing that shit. That's why we recommend the high carb, low fat vegan lifestyle. It definitely helps repair the metabolic damage that all these amphetamines can create long term. So here's a quick video. Check this out. So the question is now, Harley, well, what would you recommend for these people who want to get lean? What would you recommend they do instead of doing the drugs? Well, the drugs, they give you the meth face. People say, how but during all, you look like a meth addict. <laughs> Fair enough. I can understand that, but I don't have all the spots on the face. This is how your face is, is when you're eating healthy. It's lean. You want to see some jawbone, some action going on. You know, you want to be lean. You want to see some, some styrations in, in your body. You want to see a bit of vascularity. A little bit's healthy, especially if you're a man. If you're a woman, it's a bit different, but... Men should be pretty trim, pretty lean. Understand it does take time, okay? In the fashions, 
sports fitness steroid world, whatever, people make you feel guilty because you don't have results now. They say now is what you should have. If you don't have it now, you're a failure. But it, it fucking takes years, all right? So be very patient, be consistent, and forget about getting results today. You're going to get health results in your endothelium cells today for sure. You'll get good things in your kidneys and all that. That's good. The internal stuff you don't really see. But aesthetics takes time, right? Even people on steroids and drugs, it takes some time. So if you're healing from that metabolic damage from the steroids or the the stimulants mainly, then give give yourself time and just relax. And just go. It's like planting a fruit tree, right? People put the, 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 the seed in the ground. Got any seeds laying around? They put the seed in the ground and they're like, I want peaches tomorrow. But once you understand it takes years for that peach tree to grow and to blossom and get pollinated and flower and the birds come on it and the storms come in a few branches break. It's a transformation process. It's a journey. Put the peach seed in the ground, kick back and relax. Peaches are going to be coming. Live healthy, eat well, high carb, low fat vegan. Do a bit of sport, get the early nights. Nourish your body. Forget all the fucking fad scams, bullshit out there. 30-day transformation, P90X, whatever. I'm on steroids, but I'll pretend I'm not. Whatever. Get rid of all that mentality. Focus on long-term goals. Put the peach in the ground and leave it. So we have to do.